Those windy conditions being felt at Coachella Weekend One. News Channel 3's Bianca Ventura live from outside the Empire Polo Grounds right now. Bianca, how are conditions out there tonight? Can you can you taste that dust in the air? Hi, John. It is a bit hazy. We started to see that haze building up earlier this evening, and it's busy, breezy, and a little bit chaotic out here, but it's all a part of the Coachella experience. And so far, we've seen surprise performances from, uh, from none other than Shakira. She actually took the stage and made an announcement tonight saying that she's going to be kicking off her next tour here in the Valley. We're working to confirm where exactly that venue is going to be, but you know, year after year, there's always surprises here at the Coachella Music Festival and sometimes those surprises come in the form of weather. Packed shuttle buses, shimmering wristbands and festival fashion all marking the return of Coachella. Catch the best acts giving the best performances every single year. It's just more than we can ask for. The anticipation building as thousands travel to the Empire Polo Grounds to kick off day one of the music festival. I like that I get to express myself with my outfits. Festival goers came equipped with everything from set times to emergency essentials. So we packed like hydration tablets, um, bandanas, sunscreen. According to our first alert weather alert team, the festival forecast for weekend one calls for some protection against the wind. Yeah, we got bandanas for that. Gotta keep your nose safe. It's bad. Returning festival goers tell me the conditions like the beaming sun and gusty winds give the desert its charm. I cannot be more excited. I feel like the wind brings something to it. Some cool weather. Yes, for sure. They're willing to embrace the experience and weather it all. It's all about the experience. A Coachella experience is a bundle of friendship, music. It's all about making new friends um, and just being sort of in an environment where you can sort of let loose and you know have a good time. There you heard it. Festival goers are trying to make the most of this once in a lifetime experience, regardless of the weather. And a lot of festival goers that we spoke to told me that they're excited for tonight's headliner, Miss Summertime Sadness herself, Lana Del Rey, that's set to take the stage in about an hour. We'll make sure to keep you up to date with all of the latest festival happenings. I'm live here in Indio, Bianca Ventura, News Channel 3.